Welcome to the Saint of the Day podcast, a service of Good Catholic and the Catholic Company. Join us each day as we share the story of a unique saint in three minutes or less. Today's saint is St. Hyacinth of Poland. St. Hyacinth was born of noble lineage and grew up in a Polish castle. His parents took great care of the development of his mind and soul, entrusting his education to his uncle, a priest who became the Bishop of Krakow. Hyacinth excelled in his studies and was sent to the best universities in Europe. After earning two doctorates, he visited Rome in 1220 and met St. Dominic, who had recently received papal approval for the founding of the Order of Preachers. Hyacinth became one of the first Dominican friars and was sent to establish the order in Poland. He was so effective in his preaching for the salvation of souls that he also preached in many other countries, including Austria, Prussia, Lithuania, Bohemia, Denmark, Sweden, Norway, Russia, and China. He founded many monasteries and churches, and multitudes were converted to the faith through his astounding miracles, even the extraordinary feat of raising a dead boy to life. One day he was saying Mass in Kiev when enemy Tartars invaded the city. After Mass, he fled with the Blessed Sacrament, but he stopped when he heard a voice from a statue of the Virgin Mary asking that he take her with him. Although the statue was much too heavy to carry, he found that it became so light that he lifted it with ease. When he came to the river with the Holy Eucharist and the Blessed Mother in his arms, he, along with his companions, walked dry shod across the river as they fled from the Tartars. Worn out from his labors, he died on the Feast of the Assumption. St. Hyacinth is the patron of Lithuania, Krakow, and Poland. His feast day is August 17th. I invite you to find a time this week to cook a Polish dish in honor of St. Hyacinth, or just get a pierogi. St. Hyacinth of Poland, pray for us. Thank you for tuning in. This is a Good Catholic Podcast. If you like what you heard, check us out at goodcatholic.com and make sure to subscribe.